Gastronomy, Wikipedia Audio Gastronomy is the study of the relationship between food and culture, art of preparing and serving rich or delicate and appetizing food, a style of cooking from particular region and the science of good eating. One who is well versed in gastronomy is called a gastronome, while a gastronomist is one who unites theory and practice in the study of gastronomy. Practical gastronomy is associated with the practice and study of the preparation, production, and service of the various foods and beverages, from countries around the world. Theoretical gastronomy supports practical gastronomy. It is related with a system and process approach, focused on recipes, techniques, and cookery books. Food gastronomy is connected with food and beverages and their genesis. Technical gastronomy underpins practical gastronomy, introducing a rigorous approach to evaluation of gastronomic topics. Etymologically, the word gastronomy is derived from ancient Greek gamma alpha sigma tau rho, gaster, stomach, and nu mu omicron, nomos, laws that govern and therefore literally means the art or law of regulating the stomach. The term is purposely all-encompassing, it subsumes all of cooking technique, nutritional facts, food science, and everything that has to do with palatability plus applications of taste and smell as human ingestion of foodstuffs goes. Gastronomy involves discovering, tasting, experiencing, researching, understanding and writing about food preparation and the sensory qualities of human nutrition as a whole. It also studies how nutrition interfaces with the broader culture. Later on, the application of biological and chemical knowledge to cooking has become known as molecular gastronomy, yet gastronomy covers a much broader, interdisciplinary ground. Etymology the culinary term appears for the first time in a title in a poem by Joseph Berko in 1801 entitled Gastronomy. Pascal Ory, a French historian, defines gastronomy as the establishment of rules of eating and drinking, an art of the table, and distinguishes it from good cooking or fine cooking. Ori traces the origins of gastronomy back to the French reign of Louis XIV when people took interest in developing rules to discriminate between good and bad style and extended their thinking to define good culinary taste. The lavish and sophisticated cuisine and practices of the French court became the culinary model for the French. Alexandre Grimaud de la Reniere wrote the first gastronomic work Almanac des Germans elevating the status of food discourse to a disciplined level based on his views of French tradition and morals. Grimaud aimed to re-establish order lost after the revolution and institute gastronomy as a serious subject in France. Grimaud expanded gastronomic literature to the three forms of the genre, the guidebook, the gastronomic treatise, and the gourmet periodical. The invention of gastronomic literature coincided with important cultural transformations in France that increased the relevance of the subject. The end of nobility in France changed how people consumed food, fewer wealthy households employed cooks and the new bourgeoisie class wanted to assert their status by consuming elitist food. The emergence of the restaurant satisfied these social needs and provided good food available for popular consumption. The center of culinary excellence in France shifted from Versailles to Paris, a city with a competitive and innovative culinary culture. The culinary commentary of Grimaud and other gastronomes influenced the tastes and expectations of consumers in an unprecedented manner as a third party to the consumer-chef interaction. Apicius, a 5th century collection of Roman recipes by the gourmet Marcus Gavius Apicius, contains instructions for preparing dishes enjoyed by the elite of the time, Suiyuanchidan, 
an 18th century manual on Qing Dynasty Chinese cuisine by the poet Yuan Mei, which contains recipes from different social classes at the time, along with two chapters on Chinese gastronomic and culinary theory, The Physiology of Taste, a 19th century book by chef Jean Anthelme Brillat Savarin that defined classic French cuisine. The work contains a large collection of flamboyant recipes from the time, but goes into the theory on preparation of French dishes and hospitality. The French origins of gastronomy explain the widespread use of French terminology in gastronomic literature. Gastronomic literature, Pascal Ori criticizes, is conceptually vague relying heavily on anecdotal evidence and using confusing, poorly defined terminology. Despite Ori's criticism, Gastronomy has grown from a marginalized subject in France to a serious and popular interest worldwide. The derivative gourmet has come into use since the publication of the book by Brillat Savarin, The Physiology of Taste. According to Brillat Savarin, gastronomy is the knowledge and understanding of all that relates to man as he eats. Its purpose is to ensure the conservation of men using the best food possible. There have been many writings on gastronomy throughout the world that capture the thoughts and aesthetics of a culture's cuisine during a period in their history. In some cases, these works continue to define or influence the contemporary gastronomic thought and cuisine of their respective cultures. History Works on Gastronomy Inline citations General references